Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Bob Marino here on Fish and Planet PS4. I'm here to show you how to catch spotted bass at the Lone Star Pond in Texas. Now in terms of equipment, you're going to want yourself a casting rod, obviously a casting reel. Specifically, it doesn't matter if one, you just need a casting rod. So that way you can cast this lure out there. Um, I'm sure you could still catch things with different rods and different lures. But I'm showing you how to catch this fish at this pond. And I'm using this lure in this setup. Once again, a casting rod, casting reel, and a mini bass jig. Now before I demonstrate the rest, please click subscribe so that way you can see future content that we'll be posting up. We'd appreciate it. Now, to start off, there's many different ways to catch fish. Even in this case, the spotted bass. There's many different lures you can use. There's obviously many different environments or habitats that they live in. They can grow to different ages and sizes. The same lure is not going to work for all ages, all sizes, and all habitats. That I can guarantee you. But at this pond, in this scenario, with this lure and this rod, this is what you can catch. As you can tell, I've already had the lure sitting in the water for at least a minute. Just to show you that, once you cast that lure in, you don't have to immediately start reeling it in. You can let it sit for a bit. Now in the next clip, I'm going to show you a little more technique on the rod and how to do this. Now obviously using your L2 to aim to where you want to cast to. What you're going to want to do with the rod is use the L2 button. Once you get that lure to settle on the floor of the pond, use the L2 button to pop it up off the floor. At times you'll see an icon or an indicator come up and say stop and go. That's because they're telling you to, to, to do this. To pop that rod, to give it a little reel to get the lure to come in. Once you do so, let her sit on the bottom. Give it one reel to get the slack out of it. And then use the L2 button to pop it. R2 to give it one reel. R2 again to get the slack out. And then when you get that next pop, or any one of those pops along the way, you'll get yourself a bite. Well, I want to thank you guys for watching. Once again, click subscribe so that we can see future content and other fish we'll be catching with different types of equipment. Thanks a lot and take care.